Hey everyone, and welcome to my monthly plan with me. So, I have actually tried filming this video um, once before, and I guess my camera, um, like, decided to die. So, I'm going to be refilming it in my other planner. So, hopefully I remember everything I was trying to say because it, like, cut off in the middle, and I didn't want to, like, restart over because I wasn't sure where it started, but... Thankfully, I have more than one planner to do this. So this is, I'm using my um, October um, Brisk Fall Morning Monthly um, Layout. Um, it's two pages and you can actually grab this for November if you want it. It'll just say November at the top. I'm going to discontinue the October ones tomorrow. Um, but I'll give you guys a heads up on what's going on this month because I feel like I really need to say it. So I'm going to get started. I have, let's see, um, a lot going on this month. I have a wedding I'm going to um, around the end of, not the end, it's on the 22nd. So I'll be out of town for like a weekend. I'll be back that Monday. So it's not like a really big... I have to close down the shop type of thing, but I will be out of town. So, um, orders will be slightly delayed, maybe a day or two. Um, I'll let you guys know when that time comes. So, um, if you guys want more updates on like what is going on and I'm pretty much, I'm pretty sure I'm just planning inside my October one for next year. I just realized that shoot. So hold on. There we go, because I was not paying attention, but I really do need a plan for you guys. So, uh, let's, I have to make sure that everything is pretty straight on my end here. And I think that's pretty okay. So, again, this is technically a mock plan with me but I'm still going over everything so I'm not sure why I didn't catch that earlier but I caught it now um and I'm sorry I'm trying to film this really quickly actually I have other stuff to do okay there you go so October the top banner is up and this isn't really wrinkled too much but I did actually put something on there so that's a little smudged but that's okay. Um, anyway. So, October. So, I do have a wedding. Um, I have a wedding in, um, on the 22nd. So, I'll be out of town that day. Um, and I'll be out of town from that Friday. So, I come back on that Monday, which is the 24th. So it's not that big of a deal, um, to be honest, that I'll be gone and this is crooked. Um, but it does change a couple of things um, for the shop, at least in shipping. So shipping will most likely resume on that Tuesday, not that Monday. Um, so any weekend orders um, from that day will be out uh, or will be starting to head out that day. And then um, I'll let you guys know any deadlines that I have for you guys. So today is the 6th technically because I didn't have time to redo this plan with me until recently. Um, but it's okay. I'll let you guys know what else I'm doing. So I have a couple full boxes in this kit. There's like three. And then I have two bigger like boxes in case you guys need something to block out or you need to add something to the side and then I have a couple of bill dues and appointments and then like important um headers and goals and then a this month um sticker so I think I'm gonna add I'm thinking yeah I think I'm going to add a this month one on this side and just kind of like make a big to-do list on this thing and then um probably add in this one so that way I can just kind of like glance at it for the time being um because I do have a lot of things going on that I need to finish so I need to finish Christmas kits and then the New Year's kit will probably be up um probably towards the end of the month and then we have um 
Halloween and stuff like that. So again, I'm out of town on these days. So let me write that down now. I'll put in a box sticker on here. Or should I? Yeah, I'll just block it out because it's just easier to do that. So big sticker on there. And then I'll put in my airplane sticker or um, little icon. I made these slightly smaller than the original ones um, on this kit just because I know monthly spreads or the boxes are slightly smaller anyway. Wait, I'm gonna go get a washi really fast to add in on here. Okay, so I'm just grabbing a washi so I can like block out this day kind of like an extender type of thing. So I leave on the 21st, I believe. Um, and then I am out until the 24th. So that's just going to be whatever the wash is to extend it um, on this day. I know there's a meetup on the 23rd for San Diego. Um, I know a lot of people are asking me if I'm going to that. And I am not. And I'm really sorry about that. But, I mean, I can't really change a plane ticket to get here in time for that or else I would totally go um it's not like I don't I didn't want to go it's just that I'm not gonna be here so now I'm gonna add my little airplane sticker so I my flight leaves I think around in the morning or something and I head over um um to the hotel and all that stuff so I'll probably find uh, my hotel stickers or something and add those into my monthly spread that day um but i'm not sure i'm not really sure what planner i'm taking i'm probably just going to take a personal with me since i'm only going to be gone for the weekend and i'll probably just take a like a really big to-do list or something too so there we go um what else okay so the planner meetup is on the 23rd but I need to send out um, the monthly stickers. So I'm going to put this on, I think, the week before. So on the 15th, that way I can finish those that weekend. Finish monthly meetup stickers. So let me add in this here. And then put the planner meetup finish stickers on there so that should be okay for that and then I know um, I have an appointment on the 17th so let's add the appointment sticker and I'll keep the green one here and I'm gonna be stacking these from the bottom to the top that way um, I can add in another one in case I need it but I know I have appointment on that day um, which got moved from the 3rd to the 17th and then, um, let's see, I have uh, my dog's training on each of these Mondays, except I'm not sure if I'm going to be making it to the 24th one. So we'll see about that. And then let's see, actually there is two stickers for, I added a couple of icons. So um, there is a puppy icon since it already the third already passed. I'm just going to add this one here and then the second one to the 17th and then I'll probably find another another one to add on there too but um let's see planner meetup I need to send out those stickers for this week I also have to send them out to the Florida group so I'll probably just bulk print those this week or the next next week technically and then my cousin's birthday is actually on the 15th um she was having like a birthday thing so I will most likely just add in a sticker and see if I can actually make it. Though it is the weekend before I leave, so I will most likely be trying to finish everything and then doing last minute packing things because um, I have not even thought of what I'm taking to this wedding. So I'm not even sure if I'm taking the shoes that I normally wear with the dress that I'm taking with me. So I'll probably be scrambling around trying to do that so yeah um that is that so I did mark it just in case but let's see I'm gonna add in a couple of decorative stickers on here so let's just do these 
And then I'm going to put the other one on the side just to um, kind of like make it more decorative. This is kind of like a pumpkin spice um, kind of spread in a way because it does have coffee. But I mean, it could be just like pumpkin and coffee. And then that's which is why I called it the brisk fall morning spread um, when I was doing this originally. So I have a couple more of these like squares. Um, I actually have a lot of these in the shop now. You guys can grab um, different colors of these and the full boxes if you guys wanted some for any spread actually or for your, I mean, your monthly spread. So they fit the monthly um, boxes here. But I'm going to actually mark these for um, videos. So I have to film a couple things and I think I'm going to just kind of do a marathon of printing and cutting and everything um like this weekend and the next weekend so I'll probably just be filming and printing so um confetti boxes actually go on sale on Saturday the pre-sale for those are Saturday I'll post a picture of what they're looking like or like the preview of it um that day but it's kind of like a first come first serve for the um, gold foil version of those. So, um, and then I'll probably just since I have a little bit more downtime on Saturday, I'll probably just marathon video um, everything. So, if that makes any sense, well, like um, confetti boxes and then all that stuff, and then um. Christmas kits will be up on the 7th and then the 14th. So they're kind of like two different things on there. Um, and let's see, today is a 6th, but I'm pretty sure, and I'm pretty sure I paid this bill, but I'm going to add it in here anyway, just because sometimes um, I want to remind myself that I actually did pay a bill. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure that it came, I don't know when it comes in the mail, I usually like, um, mark it so that I get paid um I paid it like that weekend but sometimes I'm like did I even pay it or not but I'm pretty sure that I did but I'm just gonna put it in here anyway to make sure that I actually um look back on it and not freak out like um a week after so that is it for that and then I have a couple more of these left um I have two orange ones like the bigger box and then like the half box here so I'm gonna leave those there and then um Oh, I have payday stickers. So there's four payday stickers in here. So I'm going to add those to the top of these. So I'm just going to like quickly add these on here. Um, just because I did add these. And then these are the smaller versions of the ones that I have in the shop. The big, the ones in the shop, um, which are like, if you search word stickers, they're a little bit bigger. So um, you might have... Um, they might, I mean, I guess if you want like a bigger thing for those on here, you can, but um, I made these like really small for those of you who use, like you need to actually add extra things on here. So that is pretty much it. So let's see, today I actually have to do a lot of laundry. So I'm gonna just add the laundry sticker because I have to clean. I did clean a lot last week. Um, my office is a little bit more organized than it was a week ago. Um, but then I had to ship confetti boxes and that kind of like threw me in for like a mess again. So I really do need to tidy up at the same time. And then I do have to go to Target at the same because I'm out of coffee and a bunch of other, um, stuff. So I'll probably just write Target on there. <laughs> Um, because I know the last time, or grocery shopping, like, this weekend, like, make a grocery list type of thing. So, I'm sorry if I'm a little over the place on here, but I'm just kind of getting you guys an overview of what's going on. That, um, this is kind of, like, in a way, like, the way I plan most of the time. So, that is it. I'm going to leave these icons for myself, and then I have a couple more, like, important things that I need, if, like, I need to add anything. Um, I did make a goal for myself to actually read a book, um, at least one book a month. Um, so you guys have any suggestions on books to read, let me know. That way I can actually take some on this plane ride, which is I think like three hours or so 
Um, so I'll most likely be able to read at least half a book because I actually read really fast, which is why whenever I buy books, I buy like four at a time. But then I read them all in like that week and then I have nothing else to read for like until like the next month that I go to the bookstore. So if you guys have any book suggestions, let me know. I'll leave those down below. Um, I'm going to spare myself and not add in all these date stickers on here because these are tiny. I suggest using tweezers for these. Um, so just kind of like lift it up and like place it in a corner and then put it down. I did make them into little boxes because it's easier to put down rather than like little circles. But I mean, that was just my opinion um, when I was making these because I know when I've used like circles on other people's kits, um, it was harder for me to stick down and make sure that they were like straight versus like a square one. So I did make squares for you guys because they're easier to put like in a corner. But that is it for this monthly plan with me. And I'm sorry, it's really short. But I'm just letting you guys an overview. Half off hump day will um, resume next week. I did have to cancel it for this week because I wanted to con um, ship out all the confetti boxes, which is on the 5th and there's a glare on there, I'm sorry. Um, so, They'll resume on the 12th. I'm not sure about the 19th because I don't want people to like, normally I try to ship those out like Thursday and Friday, but I won't be here Friday and I don't want to be like cutting stickers on that Thursday. So I might have to cancel it again on the 19th and I'm really sorry about that, but I'll make up for it on the 26th. Um, For you guys, I'll probably just do like a double thing for that day. And then, um... Uh, the week after that would be Halloween. There will be a Halloween sale. And that's like, I think that's the only like Halloween or like the major like sale that I have planned for this week. Um, I might do a couple flash sales the week I'm out or the weekend I am out. Um, in case, but I'm not really sure. Don't count me, count on that because I will be limited to the internet that weekend. So, um, since I will be at a wedding. So I might be able to do it, but I might not be able to because of the time zone difference and all that stuff. Um, but please count on the 12th and the 26th for half off um, items. Um, I'll try to get a couple new things in the shop for those. And then um, new winter or like Christmas releases, winter and Christmas, I guess would be on the 7th and then the 14th. And there's nothing on the 21st for those. So these two days will be bundles. I have, um, I ordered a couple like bows that will match kits perfectly. So I have kind of like a limited edition type of thing for those if you buy um, a, after a certain point. So uh, it won't be limited to just those. It'll be limited to like however much you purchase. So you can select which bow you want. Um... And I have a couple for those um, for the 7th and this 14th. But those will be like once they sell out, they're sold out forever. Um, I guess I can order more. But um, I didn't want to like have a bunch of bows left over. So, um, so that's what's going on that day. Confetti boxes. Um, okay, so pre-sale for November will be on the 8th. And all right, so here is... The sneak peek for November's box, it is a Midnight Masquerade, so it's going to be a little darker, perfect for New Year's or any kind of like party you guys are doing. Um, this is the test one, so I sent these out with um, the October confetti boxes, which should be um, arriving to you guys this week, hopefully, if not like the beginning of next week. They all got shipped out the same day though, so I'm just a little waiting for the post office to deliver them all to post um, the unboxing for that. Um, but this is pretty much just the way that it is. Um, you guys can have the option of upgrading to gold foil. That way, um, if you guys don't want to do that, you don't have to. If you do, then you might as well do that. But it is the limited edition kit. So you guys can see this is one of the tester sugars right here. So hopefully you guys like it. I like it. It just kind of like gives it a better feeling for that so anyway that is it for my October monthly um sorry if I ramble the entire time but that is it and anything else let me know I'll probably take pictures of this like the rest um, um sometime at the end of the month um for you guys and 
Well, that is it. So I will talk to you guys later. Bye, everyone.